Hey, good morning to all you international owners. This is uh, Jose once again uh, with a 2007 International 4300 DT-466 automatic. The reason why I'm uh, uploading this video, I'm trying to upload everything that's wrong with my 07. That way if anybody else has problems with their 07s, they can uh, check these videos out. And subscribe, leave comments for me if you don't mind. Uh, if you guys can look at my tanks here, my tanks are basically at 30 psi which means that i'm having a real bad leak okay uh if i open up my key look at what happens yeah so what i went ahead and did i went ahead and uh see there it goes the camera just started beeping so what you're gonna need to check that out it's gonna be the following things. You're gonna need some uh, spray bottle, whatever spray bottle you can get. And you're gonna need some soap. It don't matter what kind of soap. Just pour it in here and test it out. So I'm gonna do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so once you fill it up with water and soap, you begin to spray down all of your airlines. And this is what I found out right here. Right off the back, You guys see that? That's it. There's my little problem there, guys. Okay, so. I'm gonna have to uh, change out this little things right here and that. But there you go. Also, That's something it. very important make sure you check this out before uh, you buy your compressor. Make sure when you open this right here, you see how there is no air whatsoever. And if you can see, there's no oil in my hand. When your air compressor is going out, that means that there has to be literally oil in your hands. And there's no oil in my hands. So I'm fixing to dump my other bag. You can see anytime you see oil in your hand, literally oil and grease, that means that your air compressor is already going out and oil is leaking through the line. So there you go, guys. You guys got it now. 07 International 4300 DT466 with bad valves. Remember, this is the one I'm going to have to change out, but I'm going to go ahead and change both of them out. All right, guys. Yeah, have a good one. Hey, guys. Well, here it is. I uh, replaced them. I went ahead and got them new. If you can tell right here, look. This is supposed to this is supposed to be stiff. The other ones, when I will grab them, the hose, <clears throat> the hose will go in and out, in and out. And if you can see this thing right here, it's just not moving. Okay, so there you go. That's it. I got this parts in uh, uh, Napa Auto Parts, and they cost me 16 bucks, 32 bucks or so, and I didn't have to go see a tech, which is close to 200 bucks just to go see a guy and do all that for you there so hopefully this helps you out 2007 international 4300 dt 466 once again this is jose and i'm out